Hallo, mijn naam is Nick en I'm, we're looking at the crypto market and it's uh, May 26, it's uh, 10 p.m. Uh, in the Netherlands Central European time. We've seen a couple of days when Bitcoin has gone down quite a bit, but yesterday and today it seems to stabilize around uh, 7,500. We've seen EOS going down, but now up a little bit, three and a quarter percent. Ethereum up nearly two. Bitcoin Cash up 1.3. Tron up six and a half. Uh, True Chain uh, up 19. Ripple up 1.7. And Litecoin up one and a half. When we look at Bitcoin, um, like always, it determines the uh, course of the market. Then we see, and uh, this is the seven day chart, but let's look at it today first. Today we see Bitcoin going from 748 to 7420 up to 7580 something. Yeah. And um, so in a quite a narrow range, it seems to stabilize. And if we look at the seven day chart, you see um, we were down from uh, 8,600 down to 7,400 and now we are stabilizing. So this very short term downward trend has been broken and it seems that the price is going sideways. Now, when we look at the long term chart, like one or long term, um, uh, medium term, um, then we see at May 5, we were at 9,800 and we are going down. And then you see that this chart is uh, in a really an, uh, yeah, nice looking downward channel. Um, we can draw a line from here to here going down and the support line from here to here and then we see we are in a downward trend a downward channel um, here we see that as well and now we see that's a really short term downward trend trend and we were down in april 4 we were down to 6400 up to uh, nearly 10,000, which seems to have been a psychological barrier and there it bounced back and went down and then you can see here um, even clearer how we are still in a downward trend. And it looks like it's going to test its uh, uh, long term uh, support levels around 6,600 or 6,500. Or maybe, maybe it stays here, 7,400. That's what, what the lowest point was right now. This is a support level, so let's wait and see what happens. If we look at the six month chart, then we see the top of 19,300 uh, going down to um, 6,400. And then you can see even in this uh, level, this uh, sideways movement has been going on from somewhere in January at a, with a top of around 11,000. And this is a sideways channel as is this where we are right now. Um, so um, it's interesting to see and it seems that the big companies who are um, uh, manipulating the, the, the Bitcoin uh, ch price right now or in the last couple of months, the last half year are really doing, uh, working here um, with these movements from, you know, um, here from 6,800 up to uh, 11,000 down to 6,400 up to 10,000. So these are interesting gains, of course, if you have a, a big position. So, um, yeah, it's uh, wait and see. The crypto market cap is 326 billion and that is down from 420 billion 
just a couple of months ago or a month ago. So that's quite a big drop. But also you see the drop from Bitcoin going down from 1000 to the level where we are now. EOS, another interesting coin, um, a second spot now and EOS will have its ICO in about two weeks time. And there are some speculations about what will happen. We see EOS up at um, a top level of uh, uh, around uh, $14, down to uh, around 10 and a half, and then a jump up to 12.8 and uh, a down to 11.8. It seems to be going sideways as well. If we look at the one month chart, we see it's still in a downward trend. Clearly, this line is still valid. And the three month chart, then we see the top of 21 in April. And now it's going down. It, it looks like it's, going, it's trying to get out of this downward trend. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. We'll have to wait and see. But it's clearly something uh, to watch as it's very interesting to see what will happen within and uh, when the ICO uh, is uh, approaching. Bitcoin Cash, uh, another interesting one. Um, there as well, we see after a top of 1300, we're down to 1000. Same uh, picture. Um, and also here we're still in the uh, downward trend in, in the longer term chart. So Bitcoin Cash uh, catching up with Bitcoin, it, that's what the rumors say or speculations say, as Bitcoin Cash is of course much quicker to, uh, for uh, cash transactions than uh, Bitcoin. But as it looks now, um, it's just following the Bitcoin movement. Well, Ripple has made a deal with Amazon, um, but it's not, uh, you don't see very much of that in the chart. If we look at the uh, three month chart, you see a similar chart as with Bitcoin, uh, down to uh, 50 cents up to uh, $1, and now down to uh, 6 cents again. It also seems to be going down, testing its low of a 50 cents support level. Um, with, it, in it, with every chart you see, there are there is some 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 uh, push to get out of this downward channel, but as of now, um, that is not happening. So look at what's happening at First Coin. It's quite dramatic, I must say. Um, if we look at today's chart, we're down to one cent, up uh, to 1.3 cents, and down uh, one point zero, oh, 105 cents. The seven day chart, um, one cent, uh, 1.8 cent down to one cent. The three of the one month chart um, down from 50 cents down to one cent right now. So it's continuous downward movement for the, the uh, for the mean, uh, in, uh, for now it seems to have found its lowest level of around one cent, but that doesn't mean very much. It seems to be leveling out. Yeah, but it's, it cannot go down very much further. And if we look at the volume, it's pathetic, I must say. Um, we were a, a volume of, of you know, several hundred thousand dollars a day down to 1500. So there's hardly any trading going on, as you can see. And um, well, you can see the volume here as well. Um, is going down and down and down and down and the only uh, exchange still um, where it's still possible to change uh, to trade uh, first coin is um, Yobits. Um, like I said before, um, don't despair. Something positive will happen in the very near future. I think in about 
at least a month, but I think quicker, about two weeks, you will get an announcement of a positive development in um, first coin. And um, not all is lost. So stick to it and um, make sure your KYC in the account is in order. And then you will see um, nothing is lost and a, a very new development is coming. Okay, and I'll keep you updated as soon as I am allowed to say a little bit more.